Alright, so today we get here a 4x4 four four slash. We're going to be taking a look at why you hear this noise. Could be one of two things. Either the motor has moved from its position off, or uh, the pinion gear has just come loose from the rod. So, we're going to take this cover off real quick, and uh, we're going to take a look at that just from taking that off. Okay, so, I got that off there. It looks like the pinion gear just came loose from the uh, shaft. So, what we're going to do, we're going to loosen the uh, grub screw on there, and recenter that and uh, put it back on, but I have noticed there is some, oops, sorry, a little bit of, well, it's not going to focus on that, is it? It's not gonna... Anyway, there's a little bit of focus. Probably no focus. Anyway, there's a little bit, it's shaved off a little bit uh, on the spur gear, just on the very end there. That's no big deal. I'm going to make uh, the pinion gear more, go more uh, towards the inside of the gear, and it should be fine um, until I go run it again, and then I'll end up stripping it the first time. Anyway, that's just my luck. Let's get started. Okay, so I've recentered it. Uh, I got the screw out of there. Where's my screw? Right there. It's not going to focus on that, but I'm going to put some Loctite on that screw. Always put some Loctite on that pinion gear screw. Tighten it down. Don't strip it. Because uh, then it's really a pain in the butt getting that thing off. Anyway, so I'm going to find my Loctite, wherever it is in this mess, and uh, we're going to put some Loctite on here and tighten it up. Okay, so I got the uh, pinion gear, got all that stuff on there. Let's see if I can bring it way on down there and get it into focus. Got some Loctite on there. Now we're just going to come on in here and uh, maybe just gonna come in here with the pinion gear. Very slowly tighten that up. Okay. Oh, that's what you don't want to do right there. Oh well, no big deal. Okay, so now I have a good gear mash. Uh, pinion gear back on there, no big deal. Let that dry for a little while. Get right back on the track or bash or whatever you were doing. Put my fan back on there. I'm gonna clip this back on. I'm sorry if it's blurry if you can't see it real well, but let me back you out. There you go. Wrong size. I'm gonna put that guy back in there. Like I said, I'm going to let that dry for a few minutes. Plug it back in and go. Alright guys, thanks for watching. This is, uh, well, this is not one of my normal videos, but I'm going to start doing some uh, helpful tip videos and stuff like that. Uh, if you got any questions, if you want to see a video done, leave a comment, message me, do something. Usually just leave a comment on the video, and uh, I'll see what I can do. I work, you know, five days out of the week there. I'm busy. So, we'll see what we can do. Anyway, thanks for watching.